Here's an updated version of the shot manager. I added the ability to use an existing timeline um, well, uh, for your shot assembly. So if we just create an existing, we'll create a timeline, um, save it. So now we have an empty timeline. You can see it has the playable director here. So this, we can now point, just check this, point the wizard at the timeline, and then we can start assembling sequences. So here, um, this is all of the motions from the Adam episode two and three shorts. Um, so we have like all the different animations and the corresponding characters. So for example, I can just add Adam and say in content animation desert, because I just want to do the desert scene. I can just look for Adam, find animations. Here's all of his animation for the sequences. And just hit assemble. And if we go back to the timeline, it's created all of the clips and we can scrub it and check it out. Um, gets interesting once we get to things like the camera. And I can just look for camera. And then again, I still have the existing sequence selected. I can just hit assemble. It adds the rig to the scene and then adds all of the shots. So now we have all of the camera shots. And I can continue along. I'll just look at this first one. So Needless is another one. Just look for need. You don't even have to type up the whole animation. You can just look for a sub chunk. The asset database, it's smart enough. So we can add Needless, Assemble. And now Needless is in there as well. And I know that, for example, there's uh, this silo character. Look for silo, search, okay, assemble, that timeline refresh, now silo's there, she's the one that falls down, and then let's just say add the wasp character as well, search, assemble, wasp's there, and now suddenly we have most of the animations for this first sequence, this first shot, um, there's a couple other traptions and so on. And once we get inside, it starts getting complicated. But um, for the desert sequence, that's the majority of the characters. And then they just had background characters. But it gets you from point A to B very quickly. Uh, this will be in the updated version of the package. Available soon.